Hello everyone, so it's, wait, what even is today? Monday? I don't have my watch on. Um, yes, it's Monday. Okay. <laughs> Hello everyone, it is Monday Memorial Day. Earlier today I had some training at Disney University until two, and then the plan was to meet Jordan up in Magic Kingdom to watch the three o'clock parade, and then go over to Epcot for the Flower and Garden Festival. But <laughs> during the parade, don't know if you can tell on camera, but Jordan's literally soaking wet. I am, yeah, this shirt is white, so you can't really tell, but I mean, I am completely drenched, everyone. Her hair is dripping water. <laughs> That like all of a sudden, it was clear, it was fine. It was like how it is outside right now. Can you see it? Just cloudy, you know? Not a big deal. And then it started raining hard, raining sideways, like little bullets counting down. Bullets. <laughs> so really was. she's soaking. I was at guest relations at the time, so I was underneath something, but like my feet are soaking wet, like my backpack's wet. Show them that. Show them all that. <laughs> so like can you guys tell it's gray like the palm trees were going sideways there you go it's more ominous now yeah so yeah that's what it looks like <laughs> gray and cloudy and ominous anyway so we went so we took the monorail back to epcot and all the crowds are going back there like it's memorial day it's a holiday it's busy and so we called it quits and so <laughs> we're going back to the apartment so i haven't been in a park today. You haven't really been in a park today either. I was in a park for maybe 20 minutes and then it downpoured and I was like, okay, <laughs> this is great. Um, but yeah, no, not really. I haven't, because it was like right when the parade started and then these poor princesses <laughs> and princes and Mickey Mouse and Minnie, oh my God, they were like just standing there trying to like wave to the kids. How did like Tinkerbell do it? She's sitting on the back of the flower. Was, she was going like this fur, like she was doing well and like she was cold and oh my gosh, it was terrible. I feel so bad, but I must give a shout out to this little girl that was standing <laughs> on the curb, drenched and she's just flung <laughs> not care she was she was just really excited to see everyone so that was cute to see but all in all <laughs> going home you guys missed a very exciting lizard incident a lizard was in our house so we had to get Parker from next door to get it for us he didn't kill it um, but he caught it in a Tupperware and went outside and now Jordan is just trying to do her laundry you know after a day of getting rained out and um, our washing machine sounds horrible. And I mentioned this in a live stream and my Instagram story yesterday. And so people commented like, oh, like everything just wrapped around one side of the agitator. Like you need to move and all that stuff. It wasn't that. And since Memorial Day, the housing and like maintenance and stuff, they closed early. So can't do that. So uh, she's doing her laundry over at the neighbor's house right now. Okay, we're an hour in the bachelorette. What do you guys think? I don't know. I think the guy going, Bacaw! should win. <laughs> <laughs> that is a genius idea. I like that. I thought it was good. I think they're all kind of rough. They all seem pretty awkward. Yeah, that's true. We like Colton. Yes. And Corey? Is that in the other like pro football player? Yeah, that was Corey. First. Yeah. We like them so far. Hate the social media participant and the model and the model. Okay, listen, boys. <laughs> listen, if you are better looking than me, if you know more about fashion than me, ain't gonna do it. Agree. Yeah, these men are a little ridiculous. Well, I guess only the model really is about the whole like fashion thing and like. The cologne guy, we kind of miss if that's like a real job that he has or if he's just calling himself that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's our one hour in update and thoughts on the scene of Bachelor. Hopefully, it'll get better. Yes. <laughs> Hollywood Studio. 
frozen sing-along celebration. Ooh. Annie is pumped. Me too. <laughs> Jordan made it a little show pumped. you right now. <laughs> Best show. And Evan's especially pumped. No. I'm gonna quote so the entire show be here. right in the ear. He's gonna love it. Super First time fun. I sat through this with my sister, I literally just had like I'm gonna cry because I'm so excited. Most miserable face on in the world. Now I'm sitting next to me, well. Watch me. I'm gonna be so Ladies embarrassed. And gentlemen, I'm so ready to be embarrassed. In just a this is gonna moments. be good. Okay, can I say something crazy? How crazy? <laughs> All my life has been a series of doors in my face. And then suddenly I bump into you. I think it's the same thing. It's like, I've been searching my whole life to find my own place. And maybe it's a party talking for the chocolate fondue. But love is an open door. Entire mess was her fault. Because it was. Went out into the blizzard <laughs> to find her sister, which she did. They reached the North Mountain. The D. Wait, she comes from the We don't want her to miss the Arendelle Festival. Well, not that I remember. Yeah, I think we'd remember seeing the Queen of Arendelle. Okay, well, do me a favor and just keep an eye out. Right, Mr. Reindeer King. <laughs> yes. Oh, I don't know why, but I've always loved the idea of summer and sun and all things hot. Really? I'm guessing you don't have much experience with heat. Nope. <laughs> Sometimes I like to close my eyes and imagine what it'd be like when summer does come. <sighs> be the summer's kissable dandelion fuzz, and I'll be doing whatever snow does in summer. <laughs> I try to keep it in my hand, my snow up against the burning sand, probably getting gorgeously tan in summer.
short there, though.